he's one of five boys. Yeah, yeah. He's the middle middle child. Don't even start talking about middle child syndrome because um, he hates that. Classic middle child. Um, <laughs> but he's got two older brothers and two younger brothers. So full on. Yeah. Five boys is like really full on because I've got one and I'm like, nicest. give me a girl. Oh, really? Oh, my God, yes. I re uh, Yeah, I don't know. I think I'm, I don't know what I'm. I've got an older brother. Yeah. So, and do, do you, what are your siblings? Do you have Yeah, I've got, an, I've got them everywhere, but I've okay. got an older sister, a half younger brother and sister steps. Yeah. <laughs> there, I've got heaps. It's complicated. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I think you always kind of want what you've got. Yeah. So he wants, actually, Matt doesn't <gasps> really mind. Does he want five boys? Yeah, I'm like, honey. Wow. <laughs> But, so but I've always wanted a boy and a girl because I grew up with You grew up with that, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you find now that you're married, then everyone is like, so, when are you going to have kids? Not, not as much as I, no. And my, I think our parents are not, um, thankfully, they, they don't put a lot of pressure on us at all. Yeah. Um, and I think also because Matt already comes from a big family and, and um, most of his brothers are married and I've got kids. Good, so that satisfies so, Yeah, and that my need, brother's yeah. just had a baby. Oh, so beautiful. So the pressure's kind of off us, yeah, which is yeah, great because yeah. it means that... Because um, I, I don't like to plan anything. I haven't right. planned anything in my life thus far and it's worked out kind of fine. So just kind of letting things unfold. And I think also if you even... A lot of my girlfriends who have been trying to have babies and successfully or unsuccessfully, everyone says that you just don't think about it mm. because as soon as you start thinking as about it. As soon as you start to think, mm. I'm going to try now. Yeah. So you, it's very thinking. consuming. Yeah. You know, and you just think it's your given right, but it can be yeah, challenging it's, it's, for a lot of people. It can be a hard road and not as, well, you spend most of your life trying not to get pregnant. Yeah. I know. And then all of a sudden when you click <laughs> over to that, it's so strange, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. And do you think that because when you're, do you, I know you don't plan, but is it your career in the back of your mind thinking, this is going so well, let's not go there for a little bit? Uh, no, not really, because I think, I think, um, I mean, that does make sense, mm. but... Uh, but it shouldn't. Sometimes I think, I wish that we didn't have to think about all of that, mm. you know? Where but I guess, and you do, that's, I guess it's what's hard about being, having a career and being a woman and, and knowing that you've only got a certain amount of time to have babies. And, mm. um, but I, I just always think, stuff kind of happens when it's supposed to happen and and I think I have a, a great faith in things just kind of happening yeah. at the right time which sometimes uh, I think can annoy my partner and my family a bit because they're like you need to you can make stuff happen yeah for yeah, yeah. Like, yeah it'll happen you're going all right things are going okay aren't yeah they? I think that's kind of what my life has taught me thus far is just to let stuff happen and enjoy I think it's a really really a terrible trap to fall into to think I'll be really happy when, when? I've got my house or oh, yeah. when I've got when I've done the renovation or when I've achieved this or when I have this much money then I'll be happy because it's such... it's a dangerous way to live isn't yeah. it? it's not living really no and you so even when I while I was having terrible part-time jobs and living in share houses it was awesome fun yeah and I knew that I was on the road to be you know getting where I wanted to go but it's um yeah, it's you've got to be happy on the totally on the journey. On the journey. It's all about the journey. <laughs>